Hi, this is Charles 9 Millimeter. We're gonna make some coffee outside today. I'm using a Swedish rocket stove and an air press to make some good coffee. One thing about the uh, the uh, Swedish rocket stove is you gotta keep pushing the fuel in through the little slot or it'll burn out to the outside and that's not too good. Hey, we're almost ready. Let's get the coffee ready. It's good to sit outside and once in a while. You know, we're not out in the wilderness, obviously. And I don't pretend to be. We're just uh, sitting outside, boiling some water. No big deal. No big adventure. Just relaxing. Getting away from the TV and troubles of the day. Not trying to prove anything. Not a survival. A survival show. Just making some coffee. Having a good time. If you uh, if you watch my video on this uh, rocket stove, I mean on this uh, AeroPress coffee maker, it's really nice. Really nice. Really simple. This rocket stove is really nice. I hardly used any wood to boil, and just took me a few minutes. A couple of pieces of dry wood, so it took. Filter. Ah, we're ready. Awesome. Go ahead and pour that in here. I like to use the arrow cross upside down when I when I load the coffee in. Just so the water stays in contact with the coffee a little bit longer. Give it a little stir. filter on. Now some people wet the filter. I haven't really needed to do that. Oh. Doesn't really leak. This coffee was given to me by some friends from Costa Rica. It's just unbel unbelievable. I don't think you can even get that in the U.S. The only thing I could suggest is try to make some friends with some people in Costa Rica. That's it. Give it a try. Oh. Fantastic. Just fantastic. Really enjoyed that. Whew. Wow. It was good to get out and split a couple of pieces of wood and just sit outside on the ground. It was nice. You know, smoke. Hope you're enjoying your day. Let me show you. You can kind of see, <laughs> I'm just in a neighborhood. Not out in the middle of the wilderness at all. Burn up the last of the wood that was in the 
racket stuff. There's one thing about this uh, hype community. It's been really nice. Was meeting some great people. And learning how to relax. Don't take a lot of words. I tend to be a pretty wordy person. And I'd like to thank all my viewers. This will be 10, 10 years that I've been on YouTube. Doing knife reviews and pipe reviews. I'm really grateful for all the input that I've gotten from everybody. Been a lot of fun. I learned a lot. So, tell my friends out there in uh, in uh, YouTube land, pipe community, people that have followed me for years, thank you very much, and uh, happy holidays. Awesome.